Hey, everybody, Kyrie091 hanging out with your boy, oh boy, or are we gonna have big fun today playing some more Super Mario World? So, when we last left off, we had just beat Iggy's Castle and World 1. Here we are coming into World 2. Donut planes. Uh, this is the first time in the game you get one of these. Feather that gives you one of these capes that enables you to fly. Flying in this game is a wee bit OP. Just a wee bit because you can skip entire levels basically if you uh, are a good enough flyer. Um, to be honest, you will see <laughs> you will see me do that. I will skip and there, there's a couple of levels that I wholly intend to skip, um, uh, but uh, not too many. I'm not gonna. To oh, look at one of these things. So let's see how I do. Nope. The goal is to hit the one up last, and I. So far, not having much luck. Okay. If you hit the one up anything other than last, you get a, a bad sound. But, hey, there it is. Let's try this one. Nope. Only got one of them right. That's okay. Okay. Ah! Uh-huh. Get out of here. Leave me alone. Who are you? Yoshi! You hey! Bongo's come in now. Eat this big guy. Watch out for those baseballs that Charging Chuck's throwing down there. Get out of here, Charging Chuck. I don't like you. Alright. I didn't get all the Yoshi coins in this level. That's okay, though. Who needs them? Hey, look at this. Green outlines of boxes. How funny. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> I don't want no trouble, Charging Chuck. Okay. So yeah, we can get capes now, and that's cool. So this level is also, in addition to being the first level with a cape, it's also the first level that is, who's, like, the dot is red. When, a, when the dot for the level is red, that means that the level has two possible endings. So, so that other level we just beat, we only beat one of the two possible endings for it. We'll get, we'll come back later and do the other one. This one also has two possible endings. I don't know which one I'm going to beat first. I'll get to them both eventually. Get out of here, Buzzy Beetle. Oh, Buzzy Beetles. Come on, let me out of here. So, another feather. Oh, I've played this game too much. Like, I know exactly, like, the patterns of these... These, um, up and down thingies. Like, I know, you know, when you... I don't know. I just... I know like exactly where the screen will be at, at when they get to like a certain point. I know exactly where Yoshi's gonna run to. I don't know. Played this game too much is all I'm saying. Another green box outline. What's the big idea? I'll fix that in a little bit here. You can go in this pipe if I'm not mistaken. And I'm not. Alright. Uh oh. Charging football chuck. Alright. Oh boy, look at him go. So, here's the thing. There is a vine here that takes you up to that key and keyhole. But I don't want to lose my Yoshi, so if I go eat this shell, I can fly. And then I can get rid of the shell. And then I can pick up the key and... There is one of the two endings. It takes us over to the green switch palace. Let's take a look. Ba -ba -ba -bum. Okay. Let's see if I can pull this off. This is tricky. All right, right now is good. Got it. Kick it. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. All right. Ba -ba -bum -bum -bum. Okay, so green switch now all the green boxes should be filled in The outline things will turn into those things the green boxes are cool because they have leaves inside of them, so that's handy Come on Or oh, I'm sorry not leaves feathers thinking Mario 3 terms here Another great game which I would like to LP probably next time all right, 
Let's go back to this level and beat the other ending. See, when you have Yoshi, you can't really fly. You can just kind of jump really high and then glide down. And that's cool. Bum, 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 bum. Not going back in that pipe. Uh, uh, leave me alone. Okay. Eat that thing. Um, should be a one up in here now because I already got Mr. Yoshi. Okay, so right up here is the part where I'm going to have to ditch Yoshi. So everyone say bye to Yoshi. Bye, Yoshi. Alright, why do I have to ditch Yoshi? Because I gotta run up this thing. Whoa! Key in the keyhole. And that leads us up to this level. Do I wanna beat that? I'll beat this one real quick. Oh, look at that Rip Van Fish down there. Those guys are mean. In Mario 3, you can't swing your tail underwater. That's one of the marked differences here, is that the underwater levels, the tail is like pretty darn useless in Mario 3. Um, in this Mar Super Mario World, you can you can swing your cape, so you can knock fish out with your cape, which is pretty cool. Let's get this pea balloon. Which side is it on? Oh my gosh, I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it's the left. You, have to, you need to get the next pea balloon. I'm pretty sure it's right here. Yes, it is. Let's wait. Now let's get it. Rawr. Okay. Watch out, stupid Koopas. There's a one-up up here somewhere. I think this is it. Yep. Alright, and then that's all that you get here. There's another box, I think, on this side. But it's not a... Um, yeah, it's a... Flower. Which actually would be kind of handy for these underwater levels. Uh, all right. Okay, so what are you? Are you the P block? No, you're a flower. There's a P block coming up somewhere. There it is. Okay. I don't know why I didn't. Uh. Okay. Come on, get out of the way. I'm going to let that guy pass. I'm going to just let him completely get out of my way. So, this is actually kind of a tricky um, secret ending to find. Because you got to take this P-block with you. Because the key is inside that box. And the only way to get it is to hit that P-block. Now we can get the key. And place it in the old keyhole here. So, we'll do that now. Beat the secret ending first. Why not? And that takes us over to the secret ghost house. We'll go to that in a minute. I think I'm going to go beat the regular ending for this level. Doobie 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 doobie. No Yoshi, so you don't have the cool drums. I can't drum with my hands right now because I'm my hands are busy. My skilled hands are busy. Come on! Come on! Forgot what those birds' names are. I think they're called like swoops or something like that. Um, as everyone is aware, this game tells you the names of all the bad guys after you beat the game. It like runs through all their names. So I'm pretty sure those bat guys that are flying by. I'm pretty sure they're called swoops. Get out of here, swoops! Ba -ba 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 -ba. So this time I'm not going up there. Well, we can look up. Hey! Hey! That was whack, dude. Alright. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I need you. Whoa! Wow, I haven't played this level in a while. I forgot the ceiling was going to come down like that. 
I guess I don't know this game as well as I thought I did. Holy cow. Uh-oh, this looks bad. I don't want to get squished. Look how, how the screen all, like, slows down right here. Like, like the game wants you to get squished. I mean... Beep, 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 beep. Ah, I got the five dinosaur coins. Got myself a one-up. All right. Can I go in here? No. These guys are called Spike Tops. But I've always called them Dick Van Dykes. I don't know why. Like, it... When, okay. When I was... When I was, like, really young, when I was, like, seven... Uh, my brother and I were playing this game. It's actually me and Lutz. For those of you who watch the other stuff on this channel, you're probably very familiar with Lutz. Uh, me and Lutz were playing this game, and we came across those spike top enemies. And I don't know if my dad was, like, watching Dick Van Dyke or something in the background, but, like, for some reason, we can't... The name Dick Van Dyke popped up while we were while we were near those spike tops. And ever since then, I've always associated them with the name Dick Van Dyke. And I don't know, man. That'll just never go away. So you hit this box once, and it's a whole lot of nothing. It's just a P that doesn't do nothing for you. Uh, we're, not, we're not interested in that. We're going to go in here and hit it again. This time when you hit it, there's a vine. I don't know. This, this, this ghost house, for being the first ghost house, it's a... I guess they're all somewhat confusing, but like, I don't know. I feel like that is a little, I don't know. Like, if you hit the box once and then go through the door, you're going to assume it's still got the same thing in it. What would make you decide to go hit it a second time and hope that there's something different? Save it there. Um, 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 um. So, we, I think we saw this at someone else's house before we had figured it out on our own. See, that was the cool thing about video games back then. This is something you really couldn't do these days. Um, ah! Is discover something like this. Just purely coincidental that you happen across it. Okay. So. Again! Let me go get another... They're easy to get... Uh, a little feather in this level because there's a dude right here. Come here, dude. Bum bum ba da bum bum ba bum 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 bum. Good old start and select, man. Anyways, bum ba da bum ba da bum bum. Come on, you. Okay, so. Uh, some levels have two endings, and you can tell the red ones have two endings. But what about, like, a ghost house that has two endings, for example? The ghost house doesn't have a dot, so there's no way to know by looking at it if it has two endings. And, of course, some of them do. Oh, no, I had a clear path up there. I, I, was, I wasn't looking at Mario. I was looking at the, the ghosts in my way. All right, I made it this time. So, let's head over this way. If you fly up here and go over to the right, you'll go past the other ending of the level and you'll land down here where all these one-ups are. Leave me alone. Go away. And this is a uh, secret ending for the ghost house. Ooh, and I got a bonus stage. Alright. So, let's try this bad boy out. Hey, I got some. How many did I get? Four. Cool. All right. Anyways, so that's the secret ending to that ghost house. And I'm sure everyone knows about this already, but it leads you up to this little place called Top Secret Area. And Top Secret Area is just a place where you can get a Yoshi. And you can come here and get flowers if you want them, or you can get feathers if you want them. That's all this place is. And the first time we ever saw a top secret area was just, I think we were at a friend's house or, or something like that. I can't remember what the circumstances were, but it wasn't our normal copy of Super Mario World. And we saw that there was like a level up here. And we were like, what the hell is top secret area? Um, it might have been like at Walmart or something. They have like little demos where you can play games there. I don't remember exactly what it was, but I do remember that we saw a top secret area. And that's what clued us in. Oh my gosh, that ghost house has a secret ending. 
That's the kind of cool shit that you could do in video games back then that you couldn't really do now. I don't- you would- you would probably already know that- I don't know. I don't know. Like, it just- it feels like it's like a different landscape these days, you know? I sound like an old man bitching about this, but whatever, I don't care what you guys think. Um, I'm gonna go beat the regular ending for this level. Come on. I'm gonna use this pipe just to kind of skip part of the level. I'm not gonna go up and do the, um, people. No! <laughs> I didn't want this! Get back in Yoshi! Oh well, I guess I'm going without Yoshi. Because I'm not waiting around for him, for this thing to wear off. I want to end this episode, that's all. Alright. Come on! Rip Van Fish over there. Uh, the, the, the orange fish that go back and forth, I think they're called Cheap Cheeps. I don't know what these green ones are called. I don't remember. I'll have to beat the game to remember. Uh-huh. Do, 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 do. You can swim over the top of this one. Pretty cool. Not only can you, but you should, because there's a dinosaur coin up there. Get out of here, Rip Van Fish. Okay. So that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Um, we beat the second ending of this Donut Plains water secret level. And sand. There it is. So thank you so much for watching. This is Kyrie091 wishing you a wonderful day. Uh, next time, we're going to keep going through Donut Plains, I guess. Um, we have this secret ghost house over here that we can take a look at, and we will. Um, all right, everybody. Thank you. Um, bye, everyone. Goodbye, guys. Bye. Yeah. Do 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 do